K3, Tita Loretta is going to read us another book today. We'll be the bumblebee. Let's spell B. B E B. Good work. Okay, sit back and listen to Teacher Loretta. Let's have some fun. We'll be the bumblebee. Will be the bumblebee lives his life in your garden so happily. Up early in the morning till the evening hour, flying around from flower to flower. Now everybody knows, I suppose, without bees in your garden, nothing grows. They take the pollen to where it's supposed to be. That's how nature works. Good job, Will be. Now bumblebees, from the day they are born, wear a black and yellow jersey just to keep them warm. And Wilby's was special, it was a perfect fit, because Wilby's mother had knitted it. Wilby was out one sunny day, unknown to him, his jersey had begun to fray, and his jersey caught where it was torn, right on the end of a rose's thorn. And as Wilby flew away, he did not stop. His jersey unraveled from the bottom to the top. And when he realized this, he lost his hum. He was showing the whole garden his bare bum. Well, with no jersey and being late in the day, Wilby was so cold he couldn't fly away. He was frightened and all alone. All he wanted to do was to get home. Now Monica the butterfly, she flew down. She told Wilby to wipe off his frown. She'd seen what happened and thought she knew what to do. She gathered up all the wool and off she flew. With the unravelled wool, she flew to Spider Steve and asked him for help because she knew he could weave. With a twist of his arm, she had him agree. He would weave the wool they had and make a new jersey. Now Spider Steve, he finished so quickly, he used a pattern he found in the Woman's Weekly. Moni, with a smile, she thanked him so, but will be needed help, and now she had to go. She found Wilby where he was last. She said, quick, put this on really, really fast. With his new jersey on, he got back his hum, and all his bits were warmed up, even his bum. Wilby hugged Moni with a big thank you. He asked her to thank Speed Spider Steve for him too. But now back to his house he had to go, for he knew his mum would worry because she loved him so. Now on a sunny day in your backyard, you might see Wilby working hard from flower to flower and carefree wearing his black and yellow jersey. The end. Was that a good story, everybody? Okay. Bye. See you next time. Have a good day.